Right, we're back inside. <laughs> Welcome to the Sunday shave. Um, hope you're doing well. Had a good week. Good shaves. Um, three new products for me in the shave today. And the first being this fine Marvel uh, DE razor. Three piece non-adjustable. This was sent to me. Sent two razors by uh, Don Sherratt. Thank you Don. Um, I've used one razor. This is the second. Good weight to this, short handle, um, very solid. I think it's zinc alloy with uh, chrome electroplating on it. Um, really nice. Now it's meant to be, I think, an aggressive raise. I've never tried it. Aggressive raise, you can see the gap there. Um, but these bars here on each side are quite thick and round and they make it feel not so aggressive, so they say. But we'll find out if that's true in a minute. Um, second thing is a sample pre-release soap has been sent to me by uh, Peter Chakalis. Thank you, Peter. Um, this, the, look at that, it's beautiful, isn't it? The Kaizen uh, soap. It's a new, brand new base he's worked on for a while. And this is the new, brand new base, as I say, he's been working on. And it's the Kaizen, which means to um, was it constantly uh, get better, something like that. It's um, perform better, something. So anyway, that's that's this. Look at the lovely lid, isn't it? Nice uh, <laughs> Japanese. So there's a sample amount in there, and I've taken some out the side there, as you can see. And the scent, citrus, and it's a citrus soap. He says with a sort of powdery floral background to it but there's no I, there's honeysuckle I think in the background and something else but I can't smell that it's just citrus for me it's um, uh, sandalwood cedar there's green apple um, lemon zest uh, and there's a few other things in there um, and as I say he's been working on it for a while and once everybody's happy I think he's going to release this um, so judging by the scent from the puck phew, if it uh, lathers up like that, it'd be fantastic. Now it's a thirsty soap, it likes water. So I put a bit on the bottom. It's quite a sticky, soft, sort of cream, crope soap. So that's there in the Captain's Choice bowl there. And brush, new brush, DS Cosmetic resin handle, 26mm, red tip, synthetic. Neat, isn't it? You may have seen them before. But it's a, the tips are red, inside still black, black synthetic, but a red tip. Should have used my red bowl, actually. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so we'll try that 26 millimeter synthetic. So that can go in the sink I forgot to fill. Just to soak up for a minute. Yeah, so how's it going? What's the shave of the day? What's the plans for the weekend? Anything? Well, you can't do much. They are lifting the... Uh, uh, lockdown measures slightly in Wales, uh, a bit different in England. I think we can go out for more exercise, more than once a day, uh, but social distancing and everything else is the same, but more exercise apparently. So we'll see. So here we go. We'll start a lather. So wet brush, but not dripping. Let's see how we get on. Oh, it smells good. <laughs> Very orangey. I think there is. Is it mandarin or something? There's something in there. Orangey scent there. Lovely. Beautiful. Lemons, orange, and then I'm quite happy. Look at that. Wow, straight away, lovely, thick, creamy lather. So very easy, very, very easy. Um, likes water, so we'll add some to the face now. Get going. How's that? Sunday shave already. Many thanks for 
a lot of people enjoyed the garden shave. Um, it's something different, isn't it? It's just a change. I'm just going to dip in the water. It's a nice brush. This um, knot feels, I mean, it feels soft, but there's a bit more backbone to this than some of the synthetics. Uh, which is nice, it'd be good on a hard soap this, I think. Wow, spot on with the uh, scent, Peter, wow. lovely that's that's good enough for me but you can keep going with water um, it really likes water so if you like a wet lather this would work well you wouldn't overdo it really. okay so the blade of choice in this I'm put it in yet because I want to show you it's a three-piece non-adjustable and there is a washer which just fell off then you've got to be careful with these washers uh, when your sink is open at the bottom. <laughs> I'm going to use the um, Wilkinson sword blade I used. It's got number one on the dice, so that means it's been used once, so this is its second use. There's the the head. I can go on there. Get the base plate there. Get that little washer on there. I get it together, the fine marvel double-edged razor. Now there is a slight overhang there to be aware of. And that's what we can see, but that's what the blade looks like inside. Yeah, it's got a funny shaped head, like a like a roof really. <laughs> so we'll see how it shaves. Here we go, heat it up. The scent is gorgeous, you can smell it. It's a strong scent, but in a nice way, it's not overpowering. Uh, here we go, first pass. Wow, that's surprising. I thought this would be more aggressive than that. So if that's right, if it is an aggressive razor, these certainly make it feel milder. But it's shaved, wow, that's impressive. Very nice. So it feels a mild shave. But that blade gap would suggest far more aggression. But we'll uh, we'll still judge it as we go because this is the first pass. Oh the scent. You can tell them, um, certainly tell you've put some hours into making this soap. Wow, because they always have good soaps from a &E. you know, good performing soaps, good scents. Um, it's still improving. Wow, that's a comfortable razor. I like that. It feels no effort. It's one of those. It feels mild, very smooth, but very efficient. Really cuts through, no messing. Very nice. Okay, slickness of the soap. Oh yeah. <laughs> Marvellous. Oh, it's a lovely, it's like a fresh, and citrus scent in one fresh really nice 
I heard somebody screaming then. Very fragrant, nice. So we go gathering them up, back to the tap, just a touch, and then apply for the second. Yeah, it's a stronger, stronger knot. As I say, if you like to play about with your lather and work on it for a while, you can do it with this. But uh, this is how I like it. It doesn't take long for me. I want to smell that. Beautiful. Kaizen, Kaizen, Kaizen soap. Constantly improve, I think it means Kaizen. Constantly improve, I think he said it was. Yeah. Second pass across the road. Really enjoying this. Slickness is astounding, but their soaps have always been good slick soaps. Wow. This um, razor now. Feels slight, wow. slightly um, more aggressive, very slight though, just um, very comfortable. Wow. Now I'm not sure what people think of those um, round bars there, but uh, work a treat. They're fine. <laughs> Get it. They work fine. Just a just enough soap on there to work. Mm. Another warm day here. Third pass, we tidy. Against the growth, heat it up. Beautiful. Stays clean. Very nice.
think I caught a bit there. You got no worries about slickness with this. Look at this. There's a few. It's a claret there. Soap so protective and not feeling them. Oh, no problem doing under the nose, thankfully. That is lovely. You know what time it is now? No problem. Three, two, one. Time, baby. She won't pay. <laughs> that wasn't in rehearsal, was it? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Mrs. H. She won't pay. Pick up time, baby. <laughs> Fair play. You never know what you're going to get here. Either Pavarotti's Alice. Oh, Mrs. H just cameo roll. Okay, pick up time, baby. <laughs> Sunday dinner is going to be. Well, I've bought, I'm going to do um, hopefully a barbecue. Some pork, belly pork, and some pork steaks, which are seasoned and marinated. Uh, Pre-season and marinated um, tandoori, I think something, and some salad. So there'll be lettuce, peppers, tomato, um, celery, potato salad, beetroot salad, um, and maybe a bit of mayonnaise, the onion, and cook the steaks and the belly pork on the grill on the uh, barbecue, and then uh, make up the salad, obviously. And a few beers. I got some Welsh ales from the Snowdonia Brewery, Snowden Brewery. And then, um, if the weather, if it's cold, too cold to be out, it's something I can cook inside as well. So it's, there's no worries. I, so hopefully it's a barbecue. We like being out in the garden. Listen to the birds. Beautiful. Cold water rinse. I think the garden centres are opening as well next week. In my opinion, they should have been opened a long time ago because uh, people could then do more in the garden, which means they would definitely stay home more. Not that they don't, but they would encourage more of to stay home. So, uh, but anyway, that's the result so far. There is one or two clarity bits, but uh, usually my fault of over shaving. Th Humphrey, they said the Humphreys 
citrus witch hazel. This is nice. This is definitely a citrus shave. Again, not a tie of them. Especially now we're coming to the summer, hopefully. That's lovely, wow. And then I thought, well, fine razor, fine aftershave. L'orange noir, noir. La something. Orangey, <laughs> nice. Be interesting, are you doing a pizza if you're watching? Are you gonna, oh, that's nice, smell that. <laughs> Are you going to do a matching aftershave to this soap or not? Or you think about it? Well, let's see how it goes. Wow, that's nice. L'Orange Noir. Beautiful. <laughs> All right. And then to <laughs> look after this beautiful face, we're going to use a bit of a L'Oreal Men Expert Hydra Energetic Moisturizing Gel. About three squirts and it's like a liquid. Non-sticky. Very nice. Wasn't wasn't keen to try this if, if I'm honest in the beginning. Don't like the word gel. Especially in the shaving world. But uh, very good stuff. Very good stuff. That's lovely. So quick recap. The fine marvel double-edged razor, non-adjustable, three-piece, heavy, short, uh, nice razor, good-looking razor, um, feels mild on the first pass, and there's a good soap which helps it. These bars here uh, make it feel milder, and you can feel the blade on the second and third, feels slightly more aggressive, but um, in all in all, for me, um, it feels a mild um, to mid, during the shave, uh, mid aggression, mild to mid. Uh, really comfortable and efficient. Enjoyed it. As I say, there is a few bits of clarity here, but that's nothing new, over shave and pick up time, baby. A and E, Ariana and Evans, um, Kaizen soap on their brand new base. Um, citrus. Absolutely astounding. There's more to it than there is a citrus scent, which is gorgeous. But there's sort of a classic aftershave background to it as well. So you can imagine the citrus scent with a, this classic scent in there. It's clean, fresh, beautiful, absolutely stunning. Um, I'd start selling that as soon as you can. <laughs> Good stuff. Really nice. Um, 26 millimeter red tip synthetic DS cosmetic brush worked very well. Um, as I say, for me, it felt a slightly more um, a sort of stiffer knot than usual uh, synthetics, but it works well. Good on a hard soap, maybe. Um, it certainly works on a soft soap. Good brush, nice. Bit of a quirky uh, thing there with the red tips. The Captain's Choice original bowl. And um, the Wilkinson Sword Blade, second use, Humphrey Citrus Witch Hazel, fine L'Orange Noir aftershave, gorgeous, it go goes well with that actually. And then the L'Oreal Hydra Energetic Moisturising Gel. Thank you very much for joining me, thanks for your company in the chat. I hope you have some great shaves of the day, uh, whatever you're doing, stay safe. If you're having food, enjoy it. If you're having a barbecue, enjoy it. <laughs> some beers whatever and if you're working many thanks so look after yourselves stay safe and i'll see you on wednesday for the midweek shave all the best